work out of yourself. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm baby face. Y'all looking like y'all know where the fuck I am. I don't know where the fuck y'all is either. I'm comedian George W. Anybody here? Clap up if you hate your baby daddy. Clap up if you hate your baby daddy. All y'all independent ladies, clap it up. Independent ladies, clap it up. All right, there y'all go. If y'all so independent, then take that man out child support then, motherfuckers. <laughs> yeah, y'all ain't independent no more, huh? Why the Section 8 list so goddamn full if y'all independent? <laughs> oh man, fellas, fellas. Don't argue with these women no more. If you want to get even with these women, report their ass to their case manager. <laughs> yeah, fuck that shit. Call them and tell that bitch got a hairdresser in her goddamn second bedroom. <laughs> Tell Miss Johnson that bitch see how I have my food stamps. Tell him, goddammit. If you have food stamps, clap it up. Y'all some lying motherfuckers. I'm on food stamps. I've been on food stamps so long, I hate spending cash money, goddammit. Anybody ain't got a job? That's what I'm talking about. I want to thank everybody that just clapped because I am on welfare. I just recertified yesterday. I got an argument with my case manager. Bitch, somebody lied on my application. I said, what you mean I lied? She thought you put that you're homeless. I said, I am homeless. Bitch, you don't live with me. <laughs> she said, but how you homeless? You dress so good. I said, bitch, mind your business. <laughs> you ever got a homeless person that walk up to you? I asked you for a spare 50 cent. What the fuck is spare 50 cent? <laughs> Somebody you gonna get something to eat. I said, well, shit, if you eat 50 cent, I'm going with you. I got a dollar. <laughs> Let me back this shit up, y'all. Let me tell y'all a little bit about myself. Before I started doing comedy, I used to be a professional shoplifter. <laughs> so I love to sell at Walmart. Walmart is my store of choice. Anybody shop at Walmart? If you see me at Walmart, don't fuck with me. I'm working. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you how shit happened. I was at, I was at Walmart and I was walking down. Get down. I was walking down aisle nine. Aisle nine got some good shit. So I walk around out now and I stuck some shit in my pocket. As I stuck it in my pocket, I noticed a lady was on out now watching me. So I say, oh shit, I done got caught. So I go from out now to out 10. I get from out 10 to out 15, the same bitch keep following me. So by the time I got to out 25, I just ask the bitch, excuse me, are you still security? She said, no nigga, I'm still just like you. <laughs> I'm like, well, bitch, find your own eye, you're gonna get us both caught. I got caught one time, though, I ain't gonna lie, I went to jail. My public pretender, I mean, my public defender, gonna tell me they offered us six months. What the fuck do you mean they offered us six months? You gonna do three and I do three? Somebody, nah, nah, you all on your own. So I'm in jail, and I watch a lot of television. And I realized that commercials will tell you a lot about yourself, they tell you a lot about the product. Like Metro PCS. The commercial start off with, hello, hello, hello. If it take three hellos to connect my phone to your phone, this shit ain't no good. You got Verizon. Somebody, can you hear me? Can you hear me now? I should have heard you the first motherfucking time. My favorite commercial, though, is that cigarette commercial. Y'all know that cigarette commercial? Y'all yeah, know the woman the lady put her wig on, and she say, if you love, I use love. <laughs> the funny part about that commercial is, if you look at the commercial real good, she got a pack of new parts on her dresser. I'm like, bitch, you ain't made your mind up yet. The commercial's so motherfucking good, they made a radio version of the commercial. Y'all heard it. Little bus on the wheels go on the bus, go round and round, round and y'all going to hell. I love y'all, man. I love black people, man. I love y'all. Until I'm dealing with customer service. Oh, you so spiteful motherfuckers. <laughs> Tell me why the fuck I can't get a refund on my goddamn account. Because that's not your goddamn money. <laughs> How many of you niggas right here work at customer service? Oh, none of y'all. Y'all some lying motherfuckers. I'm sitting back here, man. Babyface took his shirt off. I'm like, nigga, if you don't put that goddamn bird back in the cage. <laughs> That nigga's like 75 years old. Button your goddamn shirt up, motherfucker. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, I don't give a fuck.
give a fuck. I saw the motherfucker. He didn't put a goddamn t-shirt on or a goddamn body shape or some shit on. I don't give a fuck. I talk about everybody. GUI walking through the stage and shit like he motherfucker ain't gonna fall. He stumbled back in the back, nigga. He stumbled. If he'd have fallen, nigga, that little the fucked up genuine right now. They thought them red niggas bruised easy. You know what I do, huh? Y'all get up a big man Kelly, y'all. Big man Kelly over in the corner, y'all. Rick party, y'all. Rick party. Y'all give a feel. Y'all know y'all the white man watching over us and shit. Oh, he Cuban. My bad. Oh, that made me tell you about them goddamn Cubans. Oh, hell no. Give me two more minutes. We live in South Florida, y'all. Hey, I gotta put y'all up on some game, y'all. Next hurricane season, take some iced tea up on your ceiling and call FEMA, tell them your roof leaking. <laughs> they gonna call and give you three thousand dollars to repair your roof. You take thirty-five dollars, paint the wet, wet, wet stain back. You made two thousand and nine hundred and you know what the fuck I'm talking about. If you want to be safe in South Florida, you got to call to the weather station and tell them how to name a hurricane. Because hurricanes right the way you name them. Like if you name a hurricane Lisa, it's a white woman. She going to do nothing. A little rain, a little wind. Bitch going right up in this. <laughs> but if you name a motherfucker after a black woman, they going to tell up every goddamn thing. Like Hurricane Katrina, tell up every goddamn thing. <laughs> but if you want to be safe, Name that bitch out there Haitian and we'll be safe because the Coast Guard's turn that bitch around. <laughs> Fuck that shit. Fuck that shit. <laughs> Can you imagine Hurricane Jean Baptiste Sinclair? <laughs> This is how the weather report to go. We got Hurricane Jean Baptiste Sinclair coming to Miami and Fort Lauderdale tomorrow. Go board your houses up and pep Hurricane Jean Baptiste Sinclair. <laughs> then they'll be like, hold on, breaking news. Hurricane Jean Baptiste has just been turned around by the Coast Guards. <laughs> but Hurricane Sanchez is on the goddamn way, bitch. But when them Cubans, when they come, they motherfucking come. You think it's one hurricane, it's 18 of the motherfuckers. You got Gonzalez, Raul, Sanchez, Rodriguez, Phil. You gotta respect the Cubans though, you gotta respect them. I don't give a fuck what you say, you gotta respect the Cubans. Cause when they come, they got their shit together. They get here at 12 o'clock, they'll section 8 by 12, 15. They your boss by 12, 30. And they get mad because you don't speak Spanish. I'm talking to one one time. I'm talking about, excuse me, man, how you get to the to how you live? She's about C. C. So I'm just looking and looking and looking and shit. So I go to talk to some other hey, Haitians, where y'all at? Clap it up, Haitians, where y'all at? Boy, a lot of y'all made it, bitch. A lot of y'all made it. We made it. I was talking to a Haitian one day. I got I don't understand. What do Sapa say mean? So stop by say me what's up, then what do oh 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 <laughs> oh I got an accident with a Haitian one time. And I'm gonna tell you about Haitians though, if you ever see a white van, bitch pull to the side. Pull to the motherfucking side. I'm gonna drive behind the Haitian. He got a blink on to go left. That bitch make a right hand turn. <laughs> He'll jump out of the car to my son. Oh, 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 oh. My car.
car hit your car. I'm like, bitch, I know already. I said, you got some insurance? She said, yeah. I said, what? In Haiti. I said, oh, God damn. Oh, man, it's a beautiful woman in here, man. I love y'all looking so goddamn good. Give it up for y'all sales one more time, man. Give it up. Have y'all gonna have y'all rent money, but y'all got that damn ticket, though, huh? How many of y'all traded y'all food stamps in the country to show tonight? I did. You got your hair done on credit? It's gonna be some baby making music tonight, huh? Y'all gonna be fucked when you get home, huh? How many of you niggas got that, that plan B pill in your pocket? <laughs> Look at her, she's like, I do, bitch, I do. I gotta give out a public announcement before I go. Gay ladies, I love y'all. Lesbians, dykes, bull dykes, what the fuck you want to be called? Where y'all at? Do me one favor. Stay the fuck out of the men's department. I can't never find my size because you bitches got them all. Fellas, if you got that same problem, let me just say, oh! Stay y'all motherfucker. We don't go to Fair for 21, goddammit. You motherfuckers got 38 and 36, bitch. Wear your goddamn skinny jeans like you're supposed to. <laughs> man, I'm comedian George W. Man. I'm having a lot of fun. I know half y'all don't know who the fuck I am, but you will before I get the fuck off this stage. <laughs> if you ever catch me in the food staff office, bitch, I ain't got no job. Mind your business. <laughs> I'm in the middle, I'm in the process of, um, making a petition. I need y'all help on the serious side. I'm trying to get on um, the event, the government to try and get a new program called Section 7. <laughs> Just to help me pay my car note. Yeah. I just went and got me a new car, bitch. I don't know how the fuck I'm gonna pay for it next month, but I'm riding this goddamn month, bitch. <laughs> if y'all need help with y'all car note, let me say, hey! The rest of you motherfuckers ain't got no car. <laughs> Keep going? Okay, okay. I'm listening to the white man. He gotta tell me how to go. Keep going. Don't stop. Oh, y'all get up from uh, Rodney Baltimore, y'all. Rodney Baltimore. That nigga was DJs and they had fucking CDs and fucking A tracks and shit. Oh, man. If y'all single, clap it up single, ladies. Where you at? Clap it up and single. All right, relationship people, clap it up, your relationship. Married people, clap it up. Y'all ain't that goddamn happy, y'all ain't got that damn happy. You ain't that goddamn happy, bitch, y'all ain't that happy. You gotta go home with that motherfucker. You ever go home and sit in your driveway and like this nigga home again, this is bullshit. Like this nigga should be at work, nigga, god damn. You just sit in your car for like 30 minutes like that. Damn, man, I'm gonna drive around the corner again. I'm gonna just drive. I gotta let y'all know though. I'm petty, I'm petty as fuck. If you ain't cooking, I ain't cooking either. Fuck you. You petty? What kind of job you got? You wanna yell out to the stage? God damn it, you can become the show, god damn it. You wanna become the show? Nah, I ain't gonna fuck with you, I ain't gonna fuck with you, but I'm just saying though. If you next one of your friends and you know that bitch ain't got on a good outfit, why the fuck you tell her she look good? <laughs> I'm looking at some of you motherfuckers. Some of y'all should change y'all clothes. <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta say this though, y'all. Ladies, I want you to take a minute and think about what I'm gonna say to you. Cause I know y'all always saying that niggas ain't shit, men always lying and all that bullshit. But I know one motherfucking lie that y'all went for at least one time in your life. I want you to think way back to the first time you got fucked. <laughs> I want you to think about the first thing that nigga told you to convince them taking the panties off. And he said, hey, it's not gonna hurt. If he told you it's not gonna hurt, then bitch, how the fuck do 